Welcome everyone to Digitest Online Training. I am by name Adeba Yolua Show. And for those of you joining us for the very first time, this is Digitest, an online learning platform where you learn different digital skills. So once again, I say welcome. So if you are just joining our, um, our training, I will encourage you to subscribe to our YouTube channel where you have the opportunity of learning digital skills so do well to subscribe to our channel and like our video so um we'll be considering whatsapp ads tutorial how you can run ads directly to your whatsapp that when you run your ads your customer will be messaging you directly on your whatsapp just you can look at this they will be able to contact you directly. You have a one-on-one -on -one chat with them. When they see your advert on, online, on Facebook or on, on Instagram, when they click on it, it will direct them um, to your WhatsApp. And I know that that is exactly what you are interested in. So without wasting much time, the first thing we need to do is to go to our browser. So let's open another tab. So we'll go to our browser. If you are using phone, go to your Google Chrome, put it on desktop um, site or desktop mode. Then you go to your um, browser. Then you click, um, you type in business.facebook.com slash ads manager. So after opening your um your business manager then you select the hard account that you want to use to run ads then you come up here you can see from the cursor so from here you select the ad account that you want to run ads with so you click on see more ads ad account then you select the one you want to use so i am selecting this so after loading the next thing you will do is to click on create so let it load so the next thing you do if you want to create ads that list your whatsapp is to click on what create you can see create here so you select create um to bring out mm -hmm. a dialogue boss so from the dialogue box we are going to select traffic so from here the next thing we do is to choose our campaign objective so there are a lot of objective here so we are only going straight to what affect what we want to do which is traffic ads so we are going to simplify it so that you can comprehend what you want to do and just let me give you kind of a preview when you get to this place what you want to do your own objective will determine which one you use here Based on what you want to do, is traffic ads that actually define what you want to do, that will meet what you want to do. You want to run um, WhatsApp ads tutorial. So what will give us answer to what you want to do is what traffic ads. So when you click on traffic, then you do what you click on what continue. You click on continue. And this is applicable whether you are using mobile phone or anything you are using that is system or a mobile phone. So when you get to this place, campaign name, please name your campaign. So you erase what is there. So I will just put WhatsApp tutor tutorial okay so you scroll down so after naming your campaign objective the next is to click on what next so all these other something you 
leave it unchanged you don't need to touch it then click on what next so after clicking on next it will go to our ad sets so from this ad set we'll be able to add uh, a payment select page for traffic so here we are going to name our ad set again so i'm going to just put okay add whatsapp one so you name your whole you can put what one so you can put anything you like any name you like so name will not affect the result you are getting so here it said conversion location this one is telling us where you want people to go to that's what it's telling us so is it to website no is it to app? no is it messenger no then you see whatsapp yes and if you want people to be calling you when they see your hard band, this is the option you choose but our whole objective is what whatsapp we want people to be messaging us on whatsapp which is what most people will prefer then you click on what whatsapp so the next thing we are going to do immediately we click on whatsapp is telling us to select the page that i want to use to run the hard part so i believe by that by now you already have your own page so if you are yet to um, create a page please create it now so we are going to select a page so let's select this um, page so look at this eh? whatsapp number not connected so what this one is telling us is that this particular page has not been connected to any whatsapp so we are going to click on it you can see the dialog box so this one is telling us that we should connect a whatsapp number so here you will have your whatsapp number either you are in nigeria ghana Cameroon, Kenya, Uganda, Zambia, or any country in which you are. You will, if you are in Ghana, you will see it's Ghana that will appear here. If it's a Cameroon, then you put your what? Your phone number here. So, um, you type in your phone number, then you click on what? Continue. It will connect your WhatsApp number to your page. I want to believe you are following so here i'm going to select the page i've already connected to um to my number so if you look at this we said number i'm connected to you can see the number so by doing this when people see my adverts if they message me i will get response i'll get their message with this number on my whatsapp so if my ask you to confirm to accept a uh, um facebook uh, ad policy so if he's asking you to do that then you click on the option that you see make sure you accept um their policy then you continue your advert then the next section is what um budget so let me briefly go back again look at this conversion um uh, conversion area is asking us to select where we want the advert to go which is whatsapp then from under it we select uh, a page then we connect it to whatsapp so the next segment is telling us to um, choose budget so if you are in ghana you can use dollar the currency will not be naira but if you are in nigeria the currency will be naira if you are in cameroon you will use dollar and so on and so forth um, depending on the country in which you are so i'm going to put uh, any amount so you can put any amount so i'm going to put 500 naira so after setting your budget this section you don't need to touch it just leave it and move on then this section look at the audience section now this audience section is asking us to select the location we want to run our house to if you're in cameroon you run to cameroon 
except if you are uh, selling digital products. Then here you can select the age range. If you want to target the young, if you want to target the old, then you can do your targeting. Then if it is the product you are selling, if it is only male product or female product, is, this is where you select. When you put your cursor on it, you see the option to edit, then you edit. So, then placement, automatic. By this automatic, okay, let's check manual so that you understand what we are talking about. It will bring out some options. You can see where um, placement is simply telling us areas where your advert will show. Is it on Facebook, audience network, Instagram? But if you choose automatic, it will show in in all. So let's use automatic. I prefer using automatic. So then you scroll down. The next thing is to click on what next. So the last segment is where we will put our um, text, the picture we have to run the hard part. So then add name. You give it a name. So you scroll down, you know, you scroll down after giving it a name. You don't need to tamper with all this. Just scroll down. It's a single image or video. You don't need to tamper with it. Then you come here. Then you select the image you want to use. So I'll briefly select the image. This video must not be more than 15 minutes. So let me briefly select the image I want to use to run the advert. So if you want to upload your image, you click here and upload and you select your image from your computer or your phone. So let me use one of these. So let me use this. I'll click next. I don't need to tamper too much on this, but if you want to try it out, you can try it out. Then let me click next again. then done so the next thing we need to do is to use our primary text to enter our primary text okay let me briefly explain something here you can see the preview of our adverts anytime you see any advert on facebook this is how the advert may likely appear. Can you see? This is how the advert may likely appear. You can see here now there is no text. So we are going to add the primary text. Okay, let me add this primary text. Um, okay. So for those of you seeing my heart, this is more likely of what you do see online. Can you see? So. So the primary text is very important. So you had your primary text, then your headline. If you are selling physical products, you may have free delivery, payment on delivery, depending or chat with us on WhatsApp. So the headline, let me show you where the headline from here. So we can see. Consider chat with us. So consider chat with us here. Can you see chat with us? You can see the WhatsApp uh, um, logo here. Uh, logo icon. So having said that, you don't need to tamper with too much thing here. You can see the few things. It said description is optional. You don't need it. I don't use it. So the important thing is your what your primary text and what headline. The primary text and headline. So when you are done, you check up. If there's around this place, if there is error on your advert, you will see it here that okay, so so advert is having error. But you can see from what I've done now, there is no error. I've done. I don't tap out with too much things. I just select those ones that I know is useful 
for this training. So if you are following, the, if you follow the same step I followed, you also get the same result I'm getting. So after said and done, then you do what you click on what publish. Then your hardware to go. So thank you for joining me on my training.